Good morning guys and welcome back to the channel. In today's episode, probably the first of uh, two or three, uh, we're going to upgrade uh, the battery inside the Toyota Coms. Actually, I have uh, 20 cells and what I want to do is to arrive at 40 cells. So uh, keeping always the 20 uh, P uh, configuration, uh, we are going to double the capacity of the battery, hoping that uh, as a final result, we can have uh, a better distance range. I say hoping because uh, I don't know why, but actually with this current configuration, it's not going uh, as far as I actually want. So let's try it out. We will start removing the base and uh, here is the system that is managing all the charge with uh, the 200 volt uh, charger like the one that you can find uh, uh, in a gas station or uh, any kind of parking area. Uh, we will remove everything and we will disassemble the whole battery. Beefy BMS, it's removed. I have uh, written down P minus P minus part because, uh, as you probably remember from my previous video, I had to change some of the cable uh, for convenience. And now uh, we are going to disconnect all the cell one by one. battery disassembled the next things that we have to do is to balance them because uh, if we put battery with uh, different voltage all together it's not good and uh, in order to add the, the other 20 I have to make sure that all the configuration of the battery will have a final output in voltage as a as, as, as similar as possible. So the variation needs to be really, really small. So we are going to bring these 10 cells to four volts uh, so that we can equalize them. And then we go with other 10 and then other 10 and then the final 10. So now the um, bench charger, bench tester, whatever you call it, I don't know the name in English, is a uh, charging the battery at full volt and actually just at 0 0.9 ampere. I put that the maximum can be 10 ampere. So it means that they may be pretty full. Uh, that's good for us, but uh, yeah, we we'll let them charge. And then uh, in the meanwhile, we prepare the next battery pack. And that's all for today's short episode. We will see in the next one when uh, all the batteries uh, will be charged at the same voltage, uh, full in uh, capacity as well. We will start building the new battery pack with 40 cells in total. And uh, I will need to find a way to make it in a two level because uh, of course the comms uh, has the space that it has and I don't want yet to remove the old lead acid cells because I still trust them they are not too bad and I can still run uh, for a while with them uh, as well. Okay thank you for watching and see you in the next one. Bye!